it's a great day for a drive, especially in a 2022 Honda Civic Sport Touring Edition. And this has a gray blue exterior, black interior, seating for five, four doors and a hatch. And it has a 1.4 liter four cylinder engine paired with a six speed manual transmission. And it's a front wheel drive. It also has a moonroof, navigation, reverse camera, and so many other features. Stay tuned, we're gonna have a look under the hood and inside and out. And if you'd like to take this little test, this little vehicle out for a test drive, you can book that online at islandford.ca. This is a 1.4 liter four cylinder engine paired with a manual transmission and it's a front wheel drive. Let's have a look inside. Speaker in the door, as well as power locks, windows, and mirrors. The driver's seat is powered, and you have a nice carpeted mat on the floor. And down here is your parking sensors, traction control, and you have your lighting controls as well. And then on the face of the steering wheel, we have the volume, as well as your cruise control and lane keeping. Now this is a push start, so my foot's on the brake, key's in the pocket, and we're going to push the engine start stop button. On the dash, any important messages will appear in your odometer reading, and in the center we have our display screen. So I'm going to put us back into reverse, and you're going to see where we are in space, and then you've got the lines as well as the yellow li dotted lines and solid lines there to show you just how close you are to other objects or vehicles when going in reverse. I'm going to put us back into neutral position here and I've got my foot on the brake. Right now we're on the home screen so it's showing us the different options, Bluetooth, smartphone connection, Sirius XM and you have AM, FM as well. You've got your navigation. Now always be sure when you have navigation and we've been caught up with this, you'll see the map and everything else but you want to make sure that it actually has it and so you can go in further into the display to see if it gives you the option to be able to put in an address and actually locate it because you need an SD card to be able to do that. I'm going to go back home and again you can just touch into the different options. You've got your USB, there's the AM there and your link, your Honda link and your updates and so forth and you can go back in there um, slide through just by touching the screen. Your volume is located there and then you've got your favorites down at the bottom, hazard lights, and then you have your dual climate control as well as AC, your rear defrost and heated side view mirror. There's your front defrost and heated seats for both driver and passenger. Down below we've got the USB and the 12 volt and then you've got your charger location there and it's just warning you not to put any metal there. You have Econ off to the side here. When you press it, it'll appear on the right hand side. Press again, it'll go off. Auto stop start and that's for less idle time. You've got a six speed manual transmission and there's your electronic parking brake and your brake hold. So brake hold is if you're on uh, say a hill and incline or you're towing, you would use the brake hold. It keeps you in place. A couple of cup holders and then your armrest opens up and this just flips right open and lots of room down there. And then off to the side is your glove compartment. You also have the garage door opener and you have an auto dimming rear view mirror. There is your lighting controls and you also have a sunglass holder and there's a, a powered moonroof. Now I'm not gonna open it, it's still a little bit wet, but the screen that goes across is manual. So you can just slide that right across if you need it. You're seeing the Bose badging for your uh, speaker system. And you also have a grab handle up top. That just makes it easier to get in. Inch wheels, mud flap, body colored door handle, driver's side fuel cap, windshield wiper in the rear as well. You've got a backup camera and that's just below the light or just above the license plate holder, backup sensors on your bumper. And when you want to open up that hatch, you simply click the fob and it'll release it. And then you just put your hand underneath and lift right up. And there's lots of room back here. You've got a light and hooks as well as tabs. And then you can open this up. Your spare tire and your jack are located there and just pop that back down. And then when you're ready to close it up, there's a handle to the right or the left. Simply put your hand in, pull down, and it's now securely closed. You can then lock everything up and walk away or jump in and head out on your latest adventure. Speaker in the door, as well as heated seat controls that are located right here and power windows. There's seating for three in the back with a 60-40 split. And you just put your hand at the back, pull it down, and you now have access to the back cargo area. Anchors are on the back of the seat to be able to tether baby seats. And then just give it a push back into the upright position. There's an armrest with a couple of cup holders, carpeted mats on the floor, and slim pockets on the back of the front seat. You have USB outlets. There's a moon roof up front, lighting, 
and hooks and handles. Wiper in the rear, privacy glass in the back windows, adjustable side view mirrors with blind spot information system, and these side view mirrors are also heated, halogen headlights, fog lights, and so many more reasons to visit us. If you like this video and would like to see more, please subscribe. We have plenty to share with you, and we'd love to hear your comments.